what we're going to do, so this is going to do the exact same thing as this. It's going to tell us the gravity. So obviously since this beer is already finished, we're not going to know the original gravity. We're just going to know the finished gravity, okay. which will be closer to this 1.1. Beer always has a little bit more, so this will be probably 10, 10, 1.0, 1, 1, 0. Okay. Be. So all I'm going to do um, is I'm just going to let's get that drop off. Same graph you have one point zero whatever. So we're looking at that line at the bottom? Yeah, so you're looking at where the blue blue and white meet. Okay. So it's a double set. Also you might need you might need to turn the thingy to make it focus. Uh, okay, now at this I can see it's between five and ten. Like almost. So now look at the number on the right. Oh, number on the right. Yeah. So okay. the one you're looking at is great. It's like right below 1.030. 1 0 0 is like better than more. So yeah, so that, so I use this, so that way I don't have to waste 10 ounces of whatever my solution is. Ah. Um, so this, I think costs, I'm gonna, I hate to say it, I'm gonna say it, uh, it's like $18 on Amazon, and I don't have any in stock, so um, I would go to Amazon. But yeah, these things are awesome. This is a refract comma, refract cool. comma. Uh, there's two different ones, just like hydrometer. There's one for your wine and beer, that's the one you all want, and there's one for distilling, which you probably want that one too. You probably want both of them. <laughs> so, yeah. you end up with a server rack of air stills, is what's going to happen. Hey, that sounds awesome. That sounds